Okay, so I've got two camera cases here. The SKB3I-2011-7D dash dash L and the Pelican 1510, which I assume most people are familiar with. Um, these cases are essentially the exact same size um, on the out exterior dimensions. Um, there are some differences. Um, starting with, we'll just start with the handle, right? So on the on the SKB case, you've got kind of a long, skinny handle, and it it, um, it kind of clicks into place. It kind of kind of has a little bit of a something that holds it there, and then it rotates up to ninety degrees and has a positive stop. Versus on the Pelican case. You have a little bit fatter, a little bit shorter handle. Um, it's actually probably a little bit more comfortable to hold, especially if the case is heavy. If you've got a bunch of gear in there, which I usually do. Um, and it rotates up past 90 uh, quite a bit. As you can see, and there's no real stop. It just kind of just kind of hangs out there. Um, if you go down to the end of the case, you can see the Pelican. We have a handle at the top. Similar, a little shorter. Same basic thing. Um, and then on the SKB case, you go to the opposite side, and you have a handle at top a little bit shorter. Again, goes up to 90 and kind of locks into place slightly. Um, <clears throat> on the SKB case, you have the latches, right? So let's talk about latches because everybody's always interested in how to keeping their gear secure. Um, there's a little... click inside the latch, you have to pull the latch, and then it opens, and it clicks into place. So if you just pull, it won't open. you got to reach inside, pull that, and the latch opens. On, this, on the Pelicans, as most people are familiar with, half click, and then full click opens. Um, so that's that. And then as far as the pool handle, all right, they both got a pool handle. Um, let's compare these real quick. On the SKB, there's a little red button at the top. You push that in, handle pulls up. Slides down. On the Pelican, of course, you just got this little piece of plastic. That you gotta kind of push in. <laughs> Pull up, and then it down pops into place. Um, as you can see on the on the Pelicans, there's kind of this attachment for the handle. It just kind of screws in. It's kind of on the outside of the case. In this KB, it's designed into the case. Uh, I mean, it still looks like it probably does come out. I haven't taken it apart, but but it's designed into like a they, they put a notch in the case. And stuck it inside so it doesn't stick out as far. Um, let's talk about wheels for a second. In the SKB case, it came with these um, like rollerblade type wheels. And they're a little, looks like there's just like a screw that goes in here that holds them in. Um, on the Pelican case, I've replaced mine. Um, you can see the wheel that actually fits in there. This is the biggest wheel I could find that would fit. is a little bit thinner. Um, the original ones were kind of hard and they didn't roll very well. Um, so a lot of guys replace them with rollerblade wheels or with luggage wheels. Um, the SKB case has basically already done that with a little bit nicer wheel, um, in my opinion. It, it's just a little fatter. It rolls a little nicer and smoother than the default Pelican wheels. Um, so now we'll talk about the insides of them real quick. In the SKB case, I have the 7DO, which stands for the 
one with the laptop pocket. Right, I have my laptop in there. Um, there's a little spot here for like uh, power cords and things. But as you can see, I have my power cord down here. Why is that? Well, the problem is that I shoot a Nikon D4S, which fits in the case, but it sticks up um, because of the, the grip, right? It sticks up slightly above the top of the case. Um, so if I put the power cord in here, there's not enough room. If I put the power cord up here, then there's not enough room when it closes, it'll hit the top of the camera and it won't close properly. So um, you can see it, it has a nice solid close. It all closes. The hinges are nice and solid. Um, on the other side here, I have an Nikon D810 um, with the grip off because of the same issue with the laptop up here. I can't close it with the grip on. So I have to keep the grip down here separately if I want to use that. Um, so you can see I fit quite a bit. I got a 24 to 70 or a 70 to 200 on the D4S. I got a 24 to 70 back here. I have an 85 millimeter here. I got some batteries. I have a flash here. Um, I got some pocket wizards in here. I have a few different pocket wizards. Um, I got a one fork extender down there, a 50 millimeter, and then some bit of gap tape and some random stuff here and a little bit of stuff up in these pockets here. Um, if we go back to the Pelican, <coughs> you can see one of the big differences um, on the interior. The Pelican case is black and it only has one big center divider and then some dividers going down. Um, on this one you have kind of two L-shaped dividers so that your cameras go at each end. Um, and then you have the space in the middle and then space on each side. So a little bit more space in the back side than the front side, which can only really fit some stuff that's really thin. Uh, this is only maybe a couple inches wide. Um, it's kind of a preference what you like better. I do like the gray interior. It makes things a little easier to find, a little easier to see, as most of your equipment is black. Um, as opposed to the black interior where everything's black and it just kind of like blends in and you can lose stuff in there. It'd be hard to find, uh, especially when you're working. <clears throat> the reason I went to the SKB or I bought the SKB is because I had originally bought the Pelican with this instead of with the laptop. And I wanted to be able to carry my laptop as well. And you can't buy, as far as I can find, from Pelican the lid, the laptop lid separately. Or I did find it one place, but it was 150 bucks, and so for 220, I bought this whole case. I don't know. Um, right now, I'm pretty happy with the SKB. I wish it was a little fatter. I wish that a professional camera would fit all the way down. But you have the same issue with the Pelican case. That's really an issue of airline regulations, as these are. Um, able to go into uh, your like overhead luggage. These, will, these, will, these are carry-on sized and so to fit the carry-on sizes unfortunately the camera is just too big to be able to have anything really above it in the case, um, in either case because they're both again almost exactly the same height and they're within such close proximity that I, I couldn't tell them you know, it's, it's hard to measure the difference. Um, so anyway, that's it. This is the SKB 3i-2011-7DL. Dash um, dash um, so you got a little bit of room here. There's some random stuff in here. Some cables and lens caps. Little filter cleaner. So, all right.